Hi, I'm Esther Akeje. I am 16 years old. I am Nigerian. I live in Glasgow. I am a dancer and I'm a Christian. And I'm just going to talk about faith, dance and mental health. So how has lockdown been for me and how have I been managing it? Lockdown has definitely been stressful. It's been boring at times. I have gotten annoyed by the family. But it has definitely been a really good opportunity to just unplug from normal chaotic life and just self-reflect. I've been trying to take care of my body physically and mentally because they're both important. Physically, I'm drinking a lot of water, trying to exercise. <sighs> I'm only human. Trying to exercise as much as I possibly can. I'm trying to get in, trying to get the sun in as much as I can as well. Mentally, I've also been journaling a lot, um, writing down my thoughts, writing down how I'm feeling during the day. Um, writing down anything that God has told me or revealed to me that I need to know and basically just pondering over it and thinking over it. It's also been a time to just think about where I want to go with my life, what I'm doing next, my next steps are. I think because normally everything's always so quick, um, life is normally quite a bustle um, this has really been a good period of just taking a step back and just rechecking yourself and revisiting yourself and redefining yourself and finding out who exactly am I again? What exactly am I called to do? What exactly am I doing with my life? And I have asked a lot of questions and definitely sought a deeper relationship with God during this whole process. It's not been easy, I can definitely say that. There have been times where I've just thought, what on earth, what, what is going on? Like, what's the need? But I do try to remember, not everyone feels 100% all the time. It is okay not to feel okay. It is okay to go through something. No one's, no one's perfect. No one's 100% all the time. But just remembering that I've got a Heavenly Father who loves me, who wants the best for me and is watching out for me all the time. Definitely just puts my mind at ease and gives me peace. Um, I'm trying to walk in that as much as possible. I'm trying not to let bad news kind of um, dampen the optimism I have. But yeah, that's how lockdown's been for me. How are dance and faith related? Um, for me, I have been dancing for as long as I can remember. It's just always been a way for me to communicate how I'm feeling because sometimes words just aren't enough. Sometimes words don't do justice and it has been a way, way for me to connect with God as well. Um, a lot of people have different talents, different gifts, different abilities that have been given to them. A lot of people can sing, can act, but mine is just dancing. And a lot of people that I know, my friends especially that I know, they all have a way, of, everyone has their own way of connecting to God and mine's just being through dance. I can say one of the best things about being able to dance is the impact it has on people. Over the years, I've had so many opportunities to dance for so many people, do um, perform at different events and choreograph stuff for people. And it's been a great, great, great opportunity. Like it's been great just being able to see how it impacts people, even if it's Christian or not, even if it's Afro, it's ballet, it's contemporary, it's lyrical, it's jazz, whatever it is, I've just been able to put across my personal message of Christianity um, in a way that will definitely touch people. I can definitely look back and see how people's lives have been changed through me dancing and one thing I always try to remember is it's not me dancing it's actually God dancing through me I am merely just a vessel I'm merely just a body he is using me to reach people and to touch people and to change people's lives um 
For me, dance is definitely a form of art. It's like a language between artists. Sometimes you just know what's going on through dance and it's 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 honestly such a beautiful thing. I recently did a dance routine in December. One thing I always try to do when I'm dancing is somehow in some way sort of put across a message even if it's about hope or love or peace or anything that has to do with who, what God encompasses. Um, the dance I did was a about humans we are so sometimes we're so proud and so arrogant and we just want to do things by ourselves and we carry the weight of the world on our shoulders and as I walked onto this stage I was really big and boastful and mighty but as I like started dancing the burdens I had around my neck they started to like weigh me down until I realized you know what what is the point in me carrying all of these burdens for no reason when someone else who is willing to carry all of it for me and I'm doing it myself no thank you so I started to rip them off one by one one by one and I think that just kind of demonstrated how you know we like to just have everything in control we like to want to plan things out ourselves but God is literally right there.
thank you for listening um i hope you really enjoyed this video um please remember that it is okay not to feel okay at times we all struggle and life isn't a hundred percent life isn't perfect you just need to get let god work you just need to let god work let him do what he needs to do just surrender and he'll handle it all um stay well stay safe stay well and god bless